Alright, here we are playing uh, Mega Man Zero Four Teleporter Base by Oscar1258 and he had a ton of upvotes. An actual frick ton of upvotes this stage had. Ooh. Hm. Let's see here. Some kind of puzzle. And I think we wanna sit here. Hmm. Well. Well, oh well. Oh. We already got a key, and okay, so we done the blue one. It looks like we need four more. Oh, I see. I see. Mm-hmm. Well, let's just keep working on it then. So far, this looks to be very easy. Oh, yeah, I almost, <laughs> almost killed myself. Wow. I don't know if the original game was this easy, but yeah, this seems pretty easy. <laughs> I wonder if this is... Is this the Mega Man 4, you know, on PS1? Like, I remember liking that game as a kid, um, but it's a very long time since I played that Mega Man game, so yeah. And I didn't even finish it, like, it was pretty hard to beat as a kid, I remember. Huh, well, that's two. Whoa, oh, I see. You know, you can just use the one-way teleporters there, Oscar. Maybe you don't know of the bug or of the glitch that you can use. You know, you can place down a teleporter and, you know, then as you put down the second one, you know, just remove it and you will have a one-way teleporter. It's kind of weird to explain how it works, but yeah. Hmm. Interesting room here. What? <laughs> what the heck, you guys? Get out of there. Best incoming. And these challenges are all pretty dang easy, I have to say. Like, yeah, I'm just kind of bomb rushing him. I think. Yeah, I think this is the one where we have not done yet. Hmm. Yeah, this one seems to be very easy as well. Um, fairly straightforward. Like, nothing hard really happening here. We just kind of stroll along. Uh, I, yeah, I, I think I'll be fine even though I take some hits here. I just don't want to fight all of this. When I can just skip them easily. Or easily skip them. And uh, that's that. Yeah, and we get full health after each segment either way, so yeah. It's all good. And that's the Oh, Ooh, look, that's pretty cool. But we're back in this room again. Whoa! Look at that, you split up! I have never seen him do this before. What? I wonder if that's... That has to be the fire sword that's doing that. I wonder if this weapon as well does it. Since it cuts. Oh no. Well. Can we still kill him like this? I hope we can. And he got me. Oh my. Oh, that was kind of stupid. <laughs> what the heck happened? The game is glitched out. You know what? Let's just... Let's just nuke him. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. And as easy as that, as long as it doesn't glitch out. Very nice. So yeah, like, a decent stage. Let's up it. There you go. Uh, but yeah, a decent stage. Like, I would have liked to see more gimmick items. It, it felt a bit empty at times. Uh, like, and the visuals uh, was, they were 
okay. I wouldn't say they were bad, but they weren't great either. Like, I'm honestly a little bit surprised that it has 47 upvotes. Like, not to sound negative or, you know, just to uh, bash the stage here, but yeah. It felt rather basic. Uh, I would have liked to see some more gimmick items used, but then again, you know, Oscarum, you know, takes games and he copies them. And up to this day, like, my favorite one definitely is the, well, I don't know if that's on here. The freaking escape scene in Super Metroid definitely was pretty cool, I think. Personally, Kung Fu on the NES. What the heck? But yeah, an okay stage, nothing too special though, so yeah. Please leave it at that. Thank you guys for watching, and have a nice day.